Welcome to my channel. My name is Tanvi and I create content related to beauty and lifestyle and welcome to another beauty video. I bought few makeup products. I was super excited to try these new makeup with you. So this is the look I created using this like all the new products that I uh, like bought and like look at the eye look how it turned out. I am loving this so much. So let's jump right into the videos to see like what products I got for myself and like how they turned out. Let's start the video. I have all these products with me in this white box. So let's try the new makeup that I bought. So I will be only trying the products that I bought like new makeup. So I haven't bought any primer as such. So I have already primed and prepped my skin. So we'll move on to the foundation. So for foundation, I have this Rimmel Long Lasting uh, Radiance Foundation. I, I'm not sure if it's a new one or old one, but pretty new to me. It is medium coverage anti-pollution foundation. And if I look closely, it, ha it has little bit of shimmer inside it. The bottle is of glass and the like packaging and everything is like quite good and sturdy so i'm not uh, like i will leave all the links in the description box and all the prices on the screen as well i think i did a good job in selecting the shade it i feel it matches my like skin tone perfectly and it comes with a pump which i like a lot like it comes so handy so let me take out some foundation at the back of my hand Okay, moussey consistency hai thodi iski. Cutting all over my face. See? Oh wow. I got the perfect shade. I'm like even I'm very surprised. Let's blend it in. I still love to use a... So I need to try this foundation more to give my like a review about this. But I'm feeling it's looking little bit cakey onto my skin. I don't know like I need to try it one or two twice more. So next product is this concealer. It is again from Maybelline. And I believe it's King Kind, sorry, kind and Free Hydrating Concealer. So let's see how much hydrating it is. So uh, like my shade is 040 tan. So let's apply the concealer. Let's blend it out. Like it's giving me good coverage as well. It covered the darkness of my eyes. I will apply a little bit more towards my inner corner. We'll apply over here. Because as I said, just wow. I think I found my new favorite. Like guys, this concealer is so 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 beautiful. Like oh my god. Like for me, like concealers are very important because most of the time I skip on foundation, like honestly speaking, but concealer is one of my go to like products that I cannot survive without in makeup because I have like, as you have seen, I have like dark circles, like anything and I, I really need my powder. I have this Loria Mercier's powder. It is translucent powder. So uh, like I recently bought it so I didn't indulge in into another loose powder as of now because I wanted to try and test it out a bit more because like I have used it twice or thrice only. So it's a mini version. So let me take out some product onto the cap and let's use it. Dab it onto my full face. For my contour and blush I am using this palette and like this also I bought uh, like around 10-15 days back only so I thought I will try this more. So in there I have this beautiful contour shade and it is like quite pigmented and it's quite good. On top my face now I will move on to my eyes and I have this eyebrow pen. Let's do the bros. It's gonna be like we have this kind of Let's move on to the eyeshadow. So for my eyeshadow, I am using this palette from Makeup Revolution and like the moment I saw this palette, it was calling my name 
the beautiful color scheme it has like i already opened it i i will not lie but i haven't used it i wanted to use for the first time on the camera open and show it to you guys look at the colors like oh my god they are so beautiful as you can see i swatched one color i was not able to like resist and stop myself and i like i went and swatched it little bit so other than that i haven't tried any color so i will be trying this palette out with you guys for the first time let's see i'm thinking something regarding bluish pinkish mauveish look i'm not sure let's start and see where this goes i'm taking this color this is a beautiful mauveish kind of color and tap of the excess as you guys can see it's like it's there but it's barely there because i haven't picked like much of color and like it's sort of turning into it a very like beautiful uh, transition shade i'm taking this beautiful blue color in a very precise sort of brush beauty of this palette is it's buildable you can build up the colors like if you are a beginner it's perfect for you because like in one go you even if you try you will not pick much product like it's good but it's like buildable so this is what i like best about this blush or uh, brush only i will blend in my like on my lid i'm planning to go with this beautiful mauve color because it's going with my top i'm not just on fly i'm like creating something and i'm loving how this is looking right now like little bit of tint of uh like blue now we'll go with this mauve color Let's see oh my god this is so 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 good oh my god like look at <laughs> i'm loving it so much i will take little bit of more like blue i think it's like somewhat lost with the purple i want to like deepen it a bit more loving how much blue it is there now we'll intensify this color bit more apply this blue color on my lower lid as well take this Mauve color, like purple sort of color, under my eyes as well a little bit. I'll be using this Sky High mascara. It's a new launch by Maybelline, and we all know like they create some really amazing mascaras. So let's open this baby. The packaging and everything is also super chic. I'm like already little bit biased. No, 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 no. I'm just joking. So let me try this out and see like how much like oomph and lift this gives gives to my eyelashes. So let's try this one. Let's open and see the wand. Okay, the wand is really very beautiful. So let's apply the mascara. now tell me see this eye and this eye like there is huge difference like oh my god hey, wow this is like taking my like eyelashes game to another level like i'm taking do i need to add lashes or not let's apply blush so i am taking this um like from sephora only blush same palette i am taking this highlighter as well so guys i have popped on some lashes because mm, i cannot stay without it so blush and everything is also done and i'm like looking like a highlighted disco ball but i'm loving it so let's move on to the last step that is our lips so for my lips i bought this rimmel a uh, london lipstick it is liquid lipstick now i'm noticing i have bought so many things rimmel uh, like uh, products i already own few rimmel products but i like genuine genuinely love the brand so much so let's like apply the lipstick so it's sort of dual lipstick on one end you can see like we have a shade and on other end it's like a clear gloss so let's apply the lipstick First shade is 210 Flirty Fling, so it's sort of a peachish, pinkish, brownish kind of lip. I think it will go perfectly with this. Mm -hmm. 
a light than I imagined, but I'm liking it. It has a very different sort of formula, but it's totally going with the vibe that I am going for. This is it guys. I really hope you like this video and the eye look that I created. I'm loving it so much. It is like bluish, mauveish kind of tone and like this turned out so beautiful. But then subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram and share this video with your friends if you think this video was helpful or entertaining for you. In my next video, bye.